Okay, I ran across this video I shot a while ago. Actually, this is when I first moved into the house. You can see this is, um, I had the solar array set up, the main one, but not the, uh, the big turbine. I had those crappy vertical access turbines that really just don't do any good. I actually tried one of those on the top of the tower when I first put the tower up and it still didn't make any power. I ended up going back to a traditional turbine. This is also before I had the pergola in place. And, uh, and it's also before I had the security door here as well. But as you can see, the house is pretty empty and um, nothing growing yet. Um, and uh, this is when I still had the propane refrigerator, which I've now switched out to the electric, which works better. No plants at all in any of the planters yet. You can see there was plenty of plants in the pl in the uh, cistern, and you can see this is I put this in pretty early. Uh, this was uh, not here when I got here, but I put the wood stove in. It it doesn't work now any better than it worked then. Um, I'll have to do a video about the lava tubes and the reason why I can't have a fire here. Uh, but I'm all passive heat here now as a result. Uh, also that. That uh, storage area with the seat on top of it, I cut the front of that out, as you can see here, so I could actually filled in the floor with concrete to bring it, bring it up to level with the rest of the floor so I could slide this easy chair in there because it was just a, a useless space uh, before. You couldn't sit there. It was just it was, The proportions weren't right, so I ended up doing that so I could put something in there that I could actually sit on to watch TV. And there's not a lot different in the bathroom. Um, the view out of the window is different because there's no solar tracker out there in this, in this uh, video. But uh, shower is basically the same. I changed the shower head. Um, but other than that, mainly is the same in there. The big change in the bathroom, of course, is the toilet, uh, which I have a video for you can check out. I'll put the relevant links in the description. This is the bedroom. You can see it's got steps on either side to go up to the bed. There's actually a, a kind of a basement underneath the bed in here. And uh, it uh, not much has changed in here either. You can see the single resistor up on the top of the power cabinet there for that uh, pair of um, vertical axis wind turbines. Didn't need any more than that because I never made any, any power. Definitely don't recommend ac uh, vertical axis wind turbines at all. They are definitely not as good. Perhaps I'll do a video about that as well and show uh, the difference between them power output wise. Uh, you can see there's old shed out there that has since collapsed along with the uh, solar hot water heater that has been replaced with a uh, uh, solar electric uh, system, which I've got a video about. I can put a uh, link in the description for that as well. But there's not a lot changed as, as far as the house. So the systems themselves have changed quite a bit. Um, the wind turbine and the photovoltaics. Uh, you can see there's no cabin in place there now um, at, at this point. Um, that came a little bit later and uh, I used that as my dojo for uh, martial arts training. And no pergola, no picnic table. So I thought it was kind of interesting to see what it looked like when I first moved in.